Good morning guys. Let me show you a couple of uh, non-traditional stretches today. Uh, as you do them, pay attention to a couple of things. Static exercises are actually more important than dynamic. Uh, when you do static exercise, you exercise a lot of li uh, little mass muscles. Uh, usually we focus on big muscles, but little muscles, the muscles that sta stabilize your body, that help you maintain balance, are actually way more important. Also, just focus on not so much as you do them, try to focus on the different joints, on the different possibilities that you have. It's not so much about doing, it's about being conscious of your movement, of the possibilities of what, you, what your body can do. So kind of like do it with the appreciation of, uh, of your body dynamics. Simple, but not simple. Feel the stretch. Bend forward. Try to touch your toe. And focus on the stretch in different parts of your body. For me, this actually stretches the back very nicely. And maintaining the balance is not so easy. You can do it longer, you can do a few sets. It's not about doing it. Just doing it may be easy. Feel the stretch. Don't rush. Okay. Likewise, you can do an airplane, trying to bend forward as much as you can and lifting the back foot as high as possible and maintaining this for as long as possible. This is an exercise actually that we have you do in therapy a lot of times after you break your foot. That's where I learned it. I realized how hard it is. And I learned to appreciate it back when I had a knee surgery. Okay, here's a non-traditional exercise, but very good. Four points of your body are fixed, but appreciate how many different things you can do. How many degrees of freedom you have to move. Stretch. See how far back you can go. Get the full range of motion. If you're tired, or maybe you've been walking for a long time, or standing, this is excellent. Your lower body works dynamically, upper body works statically. You can change it up. Get this range of motion. You can look at, you can just think about all the different joints that are free to move in this position. This stretches the knees.
You can walk around, walk in a circle, walk forward, walk backwards, walk to the side. Okay, same idea in this position. Squats. Now, opposite. Feet straight, bend the elbows. Now, waist. Get the full range of motion. Opposite elbow. Scorpion. Both feet. Neck. Careful with that. Okay. So I love the, the beauty of this is how many different movements you can create with two basic positions this and this and you can probably come up with many more now since i know my doctor might be watching this i gotta do this my bad foot still not 100 percent but getting there If you do this, go as far as you can. And remember, it's not about doing it. It's about doing it slow and maintaining the balance. Almost there. This is, this is okay now. Easy. Thanks, Doc. Good job. Are you going to go to the